Hey guys, what is up? Cyberace TV here, and iOS 4.3.4 was just released by Apple. Now, according to Apple, this fixes security vulnerability associated with viewing malicious PDF files. The products compatible with the software are the iPhone 4 GSM model, of course, iPhone 3GS, iPad 2, iPad, iPod Touch 4th and 3rd generation, and for the Verizon iPhone, this was actually 4.2.9. Uh, so basically what this did was patch Comics's new Jailbreak Me 3.0. You just released it uh, maybe a, a week or two ago, uh, and you're able to jailbreak the iPad 2. Apple didn't like this, and they had to come along and ruin the fun, and they patched up the exploit that Comics found in the software. Uh, so basically if you're a jailbreaker and you want to use Jailbreak Me, do not update your software. Uh, you will be out of luck if you update your software. Um, then you're not going to be able to jailbreak for a while. Comics might be able to get it, um, get maybe a jailbreak up soon, but I really doubt that he's going to get an iPad 2 jailbreak back up because it took him a long time to do this one. Uh, so it really comes down to uh, if you really want to update, go ahead. It's not a necessary update. Nothing's different except you can't jailbreak. So they're only adding more restrictions. I don't recommend you update, but it's really up to you. Uh, I'll put a link down in the description to where I'm getting my information from if you want to read the article. I kind of wrapped up all the information. Apple basically screwed Comics' jailbreak because they don't want his jailbreak to exist, I guess. I don't know why. It is legal, but I guess Apple doesn't really like it. So uh, this has been all your info on iOS 4.3.4. Don't update.